Hi, my name's Tony from Safety Mitts, and I'm here for one of a better word to take you for a tour around the Exobionics ExoVest. Now this particular system was developed in a joint venture with Ford in the US and it was focusing on where workers were doing overhead tasks and if you think about it in the production of a motor vehicle there are lots of underbody components where a worker may be having to lift and, and secure components underneath the vehicle sometimes lifting their arms hundreds or thousands of times a day. If you think about that in application there are other tasks within industry where the exo vest would be an ideal addition to reduce the risk of worker fatigue. If you think about in electrical applications where you're doing overhead uh, wiring and, and fixture installs, there could be in HVAC where we're doing uh, fire suppression systems, it could be in suspended ceilings, it could be uh, passing where we're doing scaffold works and we're passing up. Uh, in other things we've found that it could be useful in, in packing of shelves where, where and particularly when we talk about in, in retail outlets where we have someone lifting up cans and, and boxes and things and placing them onto shelves continuously. It's this motion where we have you know re repetition of movement within the shoulder and upper body. So I'm just going to show you how to don the vest now. So basically um, this can be hanging up on a wall or you know on the ground, typically they're on the ground but just the, I found the easiest way to pick them up is just pick it up by the arms. Um, before you don it, just make sure all the straps are actually loose. So then we have the shoulder strap that just goes over. So we'll just be left or right, doesn't matter. So we have the shoulder straps that go over. Um, I tend to just actually pull what I, I've nicknamed these, the parachutes. Um, so just pull those on a little bit. And what you want to do is get the system just to ride up onto your shoulders. Just it's loose at the moment, then we have the waist strap, just loose, then we have our chest strap. Now this chest strap has adjustments, so you might be able to see those there, they slide up and down in, in the guide, so we've just got the, the chest strap, so I'm just making sure it's just, just loosely fitting at the moment. Um, I didn't reach around, you'll find this little tag here, so it actually guides the cuff onto your arm. We'll just put that on. Then we've got these unique little clips that just lock into position and you can pull that tighter. We just still want it to be loose fitting. We don't, we don't want it to be um, tight. So we've got those little connections again. You can see how those just come in. These are real neat. These. It's just got this, this one's got this little tag that you just secure it in. Interesting with these, to, to disengage them, all you do is just pull that little tag. So it's a great little, great little device for latching on. So that's the cuff. So again, what I'm doing is I'm reaching around, I'm grabbing the, the strap, just running it over. Putting this clip in again. So it's still just loose fitting. This fitting again. See, we've just got this tag here. Now there are different cuff sizes. We've got three cuff sizes, obviously small, medium and large. Um, so I've just got this loose fitting. So before I do the final adjustment, I just move, just give a bit of, you know, all round movement. And at the moment there's no load support whatsoever. So I'm just going to do a little bit more of an adjustment. Not much, just, just to try and make it a bit more comfortable. And then you will find with this is that it's a bit like a pair of jeans or your new boots. You know, it takes a little bit to, to wear in, um, but once they're wear in, it's really comfortable. So at the moment, we have no load support. Right, so what I'm gonna do is to turn it on, you can see here it's got this little on-off section here. Now I can reach around and just flick that up. The other thing is you can just use this tag and pulling it up turns it on, pulling it down turns it off. So we'll turn it on. Do the same over here. So I'm reaching around, grabbing this little tag. You know, I'm on the off position. You can move your arm up and down actually to disengage it and, and engage it. So we are on. So now, the moment I'm down here, I have no load system whatsoever. So as I gradually raise my arms, I'm starting to feel the resistance. So I'm getting support. And then as I'm directly overhead, I'm getting full support. So at the moment, I am, I am just resting my arms. I'm not allowing any muscle activity. So what it's doing is it's providing support for the bicep, the tricep and the trapezius. 
Another thing that's happening, because it's a backpack, it's actually transferring load to the hips. So, so it's a, a, anecdotally, it's a, a lot of other benefits from it. So as you can see here, so you, things to be aware of is that you do need a little bit of spatial awareness. You do have a, you know, a protrusion on your back, but no, not dissimilar to a backpack. Um, so when it's operational, but you can see that I don't have any restriction in movement whatsoever. So that's donning the vest, and I can make some just adjustments, just make it a little bit more comfortable. But that's, if I was in this position all day, I'd be reducing my muscular activity, therefore reducing fatigue, um, and then being uh, a lot more rested um, during the work task. So then again, we can just turn it off. So we just flick that down. Again, we can do it with the, the strap. So you can just pull that down. You can move your arm up and down. That, that'll actually disengage and engage the mechanism. So again, making sure, you have to make sure that it's off because uh, when, you, when you go to, to, uh, to doff it or take it off, remembering then those little tags, we just push that, pull those out, remove the strap. So again here, again here. All right, we'll just remove that strap. We're there on the chest strap, waist strap. And if you loosen the shoulders before completely removing it, it'll make it nice and easy to remove and store. So that's the Exobionics Exovest. If you have any more questions, please visit our website. And thank you very much for viewing this video.